Yeah, it's not 100% yet. He still needs a, a screw taken out of his finger, uh, which happens on Thursday, I think. Um, but yeah, it, it'll be crucial for us to have him back. You know, he's he's ex been excellent for us in the in the middle order. But not only that, I mean, he's one of our best fielders, you know, and he's been so handy with the ball for us. So. You know, we, we're looking forward to, uh, for him to to come into the tournament, probably only in the group stage games. But, you know, the sooner he gets, gets back, the better for us. Yeah, very important. You know, we, we want to take these uh, warm-up games as serious as possible, as well as give um, all the guys uh, a decent run. But we'll probably look to play our, our best 11 against PNG, I would think. You know, and just hope the the weather permits, and you know we get a, a full game in. But yeah, re really important that we get a get a win, hopefully against PNG, and take that confidence into into the group stage. You know, we've played against them quite quite a bit in the past, so we know what we get, what we're gonna get, and you know, hopefully, hopefully, you know, we play a bit on the day. Yeah, we're obviously a bit down after after Sharjah. But I can see a, a change in the camp already. You know, guys are excited for for the qualifiers and to be playing at home. You know, there's that new buzz in the change room that probably wasn't there in, in Sharjah. So, you know, it's exciting to see. And, you know, we, we're happy with the squad we have. Uh, just few injury concerns. But hopefully hopefully we, we can field our best 11 come the group stage games. Yeah, no, they they support us no matter what. Uh, especially, you know, uh, Bulawayo fans have been have been really good to us over the past. You know, we we're just hoping they'll they'll stick with us. You know, and hopefully give them something to to shout about over over the course of the tournament. Yeah, Sifas Shuao obviously joining the squad. Um, you know, he's very explosive at the top of the order. You know, and we'll probably use him in that role. Um, he's one of the one of the real new faces in the squad, and obviously Sean Williams coming back. You know, not quite fully fit, like I said earlier. But you know, we we're looking to see how Cephas goes. You know, he only knows one way to play, and you know that's how we want him to play. So yeah, it's exciting to hopefully see him and Solomon at the top of the order and see see how they go together, and then. Now, if we can have Sean back as, as quickly as possible and also to unleash Brian Vittori um, in these sort of conditions where we know he, he can be really dangerous. So pretty much the same team, but, we, but we're hoping, you know, guys like, uh, you know, our, our core players like Brendan and, you know, Craig and Raz can, can also step up um, in front of our home fans. Yeah, he fits, he fits right in because, I mean, he's played... He's played domestic cricket with all of us for a number of, a number of years now so he's not so much a new face uh, around um, you know he's very uh, a real bubbly character and he's actually a good a good team man to have so we're excited to have him with us and yeah we'll, we'll probably chuck him up uh, um, in the, in one of the opening slots I would think you know that's why we're hoping to get a game today so he could play the two warm-up games and see how he goes but that wasn't to be, but yeah, we lo we're looking to to have him up front at this stage. Yeah, at this stage, it just it just depends on, on the conditions. You know, overcast. You know, we we've got four good seamers in the, in our squad, so it, it's going to be really tough to to actually select a team. But at this stage, we'll we'll probably go with the three seam uh, and one main main spinner, and then we have a lot of. Uh, so-called all-rounders with Raz and Solomon and, you know, may, hopefully if, if Sean's, Sean's back bowling. Yeah, but at, at this stage, we're looking at that three-seam three, three seam attack. But like I said, it'll just depend on, on conditions at this stage. Oh, we don't mind, really. Um, I, I personally enjoy playing in Bulawa, you know, as much as Harari. But, uh, you know, we had no control over that. Um, but we get the uh, great support wherever we go, where, whether we come here or, or we're in Harare. So, you know, guys aren't fussed about that. And it's, it's good to have a change, 
sometimes because we always seem to be at Harare Sports Club and training there and stuff. So it's nice to come down here.